Right now, we want to head to Allie Reed, who's joining us live tonight in Hoboken, New Jersey. Allie, how you doing out there? You know what, Jeff? I'm doing okay, but I, I just have to say, we what, what the viewers don't see at home is that we were just talking, what, maybe 30 seconds ago, Jeff? And within the last uh, couple of seconds here, it went from pretty quiet to the rain and the wind now starting to pick back up. And the last time we checked in with you about an hour ago, you would even said, get ready, that rain is coming. And within uh, just a few seconds of us sending it back to you in studio, that rain came in. So, Jeff, you have been hitting the nail on the head all evening long, which I appreciate because we've been running back and forth to our car to stay as dry as possible. Yes, we are live in Hoboken, the beautiful Manhattan skyline directly behind us. Our photographer, Brendan, has been getting video on his drone throughout the evening. Gives you a better perspective of what this area has looked like throughout the day. It is very muggy, very humid at times. The wind has come in, the rain's sporadic, but when it does come in, it's certainly annoying and frustrating for those that live in this area, um, but obviously not nearly as bad as uh, some other areas that were hit because of Debbie throughout the last couple of days, whether that be Florida, Georgia, or upwards of the Carolinas. Uh, but realistically, the reason why we chose this area, Jeff, today, Hoboken, it is a low-lying area. There is a pretty uh, significant risk, at least for some flash flooding in this area. So if that rainfall does come down, and it is heavy at times, some low-lying areas and some historically uh, areas that could potentially get flooding may become an issue uh, as the evening progresses. Nothing too bad as of right now, but something to keep an eye on. Alley, right now looking at the shower you near know, the back edge of this one uh, is going to be coming quickly. It's about three to five miles west of you right now, the back edge of it. And then you're going to break and there might be another shower or two. But by and large, uh, this was a horrifying flood disaster in far north central Pennsylvania, parts of northwest New York uh, and uh, other areas like New York City. We are evading any significant problems, uh, at least it appears, which is very good news there. But, uh, you know, you have traveled a lot of miles with this storm. So how uh, has this impacted you? And if there's one memory from this storm that you'll take with you from the southeast into the northeast, what do you think you're going to remember the most? Oh, well, it's easy to pinpoint what that memory was, and that was when Debbie made landfall, landfall when we were just an hour south of where that hit in Cedar Key. The wind, the rain, incredible stuff. I had never been so close to the eye of a hurricane before in my life. So to experience that for the first time is something that I will truly never forget. And speaking to people in that area as well, uh, that is an area that has been hit once before. Hurricane Adalia last year, came in and really wrecked a number of those homes, damaged at least a third of that area. So to be back in that spot, to really get a perspective of what those people had to do to prepare for this time around uh, was really something remarkable to see. And then moving up to Savannah, not nearly as bad in Georgia as it was slow moving across that state, but the flooding there also significant. So to end here in New York City, very right outside of it, I should say, very different from when we were down in Florida, but uh, very similar in terms of the feel, the overall atmosphere that we're getting right now. Certainly tropical weather, to say the least. <laughs> all right, good stuff. Well, we appreciate your reporting, not just today, but all week long and uh, over the past, uh, well, since you've been with us here at Allie. Great addition to the team here uh, at the AccuWeather Network. Thanks again, Allie Reed in Hoboken, New Jersey. Thanks, right. Jeff. Anytime. Let's take a look at uh, that radar. And again, uh, this is a short lived burst of rain here that we're going to be facing in New York. And again, we never want to miss it when uh, a big city is in the conversation uh, of a major weather event.